I'm happy today I'm speaking as a representative of the Kaizen Association. I'd like to tell you something that I am really excited about. It's called Kaizen Store. It's a new application store for new platform Kaizen. So, why Kaizen Store? Developers want to maximize your potential customer by publishing apps to various markets. Kaizen Store will be a great opportunity to, dis to be discovered. Start fresh in this new market and be in a space your competition is All Kaizen devices will have a Kaizen Store. We are going to put in every single Kaizen device in, so you can reach out to all Kaizen customers. Kaizen Store accepts and distributes various contents. It will have HTML5 app, native app, and hybrid app at once. Developers can take advantage of store emphasis of Python on HTML5 and can leverage web technology to deliver your services to Python customers. And other types of content will be available in the future. Python store is super easy to use and we will provide a number of monetization ways to maximize your profit. We've got the service ecosystem of Python. I'm sure that you are already familiar with Python developer site. You can download SDK from this portal and build your great apps. Python store is one you are waiting for. It is now open for developers. It was launched on 2nd May. You can submit your app to sell all this. And this app will be passed validation based on Kaizen validation guideline. And the Polish will be distributed to Kaizen store. Customers can buy or download from the store on their device. We have also a website for PC and mobile for promoting the store and feature app and also customer support. Let's check the Kaizen Store's key feature quickly. Kaizen Store's cell office is easy to use and makes your app publish the test. Through binary download, it will automatically recommend available Kaizen devices by the features of your apps. You can set price in available countries. Kaizen stores show them in their local currency through flexible pricing. All apps must go through app validation, but it takes only three days by an automated validation system. It will be instantly available in Python store. And for your monetization, Python store supports strong DRM and various payment methods. Of course, Python store supports paper credit card. For Russia, premium SMS will be available at once and France and Japan, we are going to support career direct billing and launch. Finally, Kaizen Store will scale up easy user experience and localization for support. Okay, let's go into cell office. The address is cello.kaizenstore.com. Please remember, sell.hygienstore.com. My profile application.
protection and support is available by now. And other features such as bias for accounting and statistics will be available by the time the device is launching. To continue, first you need to create Kaizen account. Simply follow the step and try to store therapies. After you become a seller, you are ready to register your app. Select Add a new application. Enter application title and unknown buying file to set up Kaizen, uh, to set up available Kaizen devices automatically. Set country and price of your app and apply DRM to support you as to protect your apps but just by checking yes. Select category which your application falls and in the AG description select age rating that corresponds that rating for certain country. And you have entered all information or all basic information. After that, you have to enter display information that may appear on the store. Enter the description that gives customer to understand what your application does. And enter the keyword in the tab that will help customer to find your application quickly. Select the language then your application support. And you can also add other local languages for app title, description, and tag. Also, you want to add app icon and, and screenshot. And you can add contact information for support. You may want to leave comment to the validation team to pass smoothly and pass. Don't forget leaving comment to the validation team. It is very important to provide accurate information. Kaizen Store will overview your information and any, any accuracy may delay launch of your apps. Once you review the, the, your application information, uh, you can submit your app. Once the application is under review, you will receive email from Kaizen Store Service Team when it has any changes. Or you can check it on the cell of this side. In the support menu, you can find FAQ, my training, and PDF files. FAQ and four types of PDF files will help you use cell of this conveniently. And if you have any question, You can use uh, my scanning. Kaizen Store Zero Office team will try to do the best to support you. And now I'm going to show you Kaizen Store on the device. We designed the store to make it the easiest way possible for people to discover apps. Minimal hierarchy, so as many apps as possible are close to you. All the design can people to click or click. As you can see here in the top, there are banners for picture app and app collection. And there is an editor choice. It highlights best and great apps on Kaizen Store. All featured apps are handpicked by Store's staff with a stylish icon and colorful screenshot. It looks like magazine's cover. So make sure to build. Not only great app, but also eye-catching app icon and screenshot. 
Uh, as I said, Python story is so easy and just simple to navigate. All you need to do is just click or click the menu button. Here you've got the Titan store, uh, here you've got the Titan P, top, UM, branding and discount and so on. So it shows absolutely every menu in the main page. So you can easily browse the store. Let's go to the Titan P. All picture gets a uh, so that's helpfully selected by Titan Store team. We will constantly discover not only best known app, not only best known app, but also diamond in the law. Of course, we have top, top page, top three, and top grossing from all categories on the Titan store. You can see what the most popular apps are that are being downloaded. We've got UN Friendly. You can see new release and rising star apps in this page. This is a discount page. It shows discounted app. Developers can offer a promotion on their apps in Titan, Titan Store seller page. Once discount is applied, these apps are shown, will be shown automatically on this page. Titan Store has all Titan Store has ability of recommendation. This page will show the recommended app based on MUC. Titan Store will try to do best to give a better recommendation. Here we can show promoting where here we can show ongoing promotion that users can directly access. Also, can show the banners for picture and app collection. Here we go. You can, uh, you can easily browse various categories from education, entertainment, finance, and so on. For example, entertainment. You can, you can find picture entertainment as here and also it has top page and new release in the entertainment category. Furthermore, Titan Store will have a top rated page based on rating and user reviews by end users. If we go into the application, let's check the catalog. This is a screenshot for catalog. And you can find the detailed information user reviews and related and more apps by this developer. If you can see another screenshot, just one click. If we want to this app, just click get button and it will be downloaded and installed for your uh, to your devices. And if it is a paid app, it will show the buy button. Please just click buy button. 
You may ask to resign in Kaizen account if it is uh, your first time, first, first time to make a purchase on your devices. And Kaizen Store, Kaizen Store not, notifies updates when there is a variable in the Kaizen Store. And in the purchase menu, you can you can re-download and update your application. We expect great apps and UN and powerful application to be de de to be de developed on the Titan Store. Build great apps and submit to Titan Store set office and see the great opportunity. And I will introduce the Nyonsuri, who is in charge of the app validation. Please welcome Nyonsuri.
application secret with new secret police. We call it updated analysis. <coughs> Most of secret analysis is automated. However, if application has potential secret threat, then secret analysis checking details. Second, a test automation system. This system automatically runs application on the real device and check basic information and functionality such as forbidden word, installation and copyright, resolution and more. Due to test automation system, we can validate your application immediately. Uh, let's look at the second case. Final review. Uh, this is half automation page to read the case, which can judge by automation system. Because test automation system extracts necessary information from a package and offer them to the reader, so reader usually check harmful content such as sexual violenter and illegal activities. Uh, uh, if application service on the title store, uh, application should pass test automation and security analysis and content, content review, application review result. If you want to service your application in the first submission, So, we prepare five keys for you. First, provide additional information in the command to certification team on the seller piece. Add helpful information before, complete, before completing app submission on the Titan store. It will save your and our time to validate. Second, Write application title and description in English by default. If you sell more than two countries for sale, then application title and description must be written in English. If you use test language, we are recommended to select a country that uses the same language. So, Made by English and switch up for all ages. We check whether icons, icon English and switch up for, for, for all ages. And next, icon must be a circular shape. Uh, circular icon is a mandatory type and, and you can easily convert your own icon to circular shape using Titan 2.1 SK release of century. And this is the size of the circular icon. And the last, make sure your application does not include some as a copyright. I think there's no need to give an additional command. Uh, uh, so far, I briefly I covered Python app validation process and relate system quickly. Uh, uh, so our goal is that validate your application all three, within three days. But frankly, it's quite, quite a challenge for us. However, we will try our best to meet your satisfaction. Thank you. If you have any question regarding Titan store and validation process and system, if you ask me and Hank. Uh, I have a question. Yeah. Do you have any API spec that you can have so that we can look into the in-app purchase that tied to the uh, Python app store? Pardon? I, I didn't catch your question. Oh, uh, okay. Slowly. <laughs> I, uh, I want to finally get any API spec that we can get.
uh, so you can develop the new app purchase uh, to tie to the Python app store. Uh, okay. Yes, it will be available to both the devices. Our yeah, last evening, and of June, we will provide a Tizen Tizen net purchase solution. Okay, so it will be available on the Tizen ORG for the developers? Yeah. Okay. And then our second question is when would Chinese language or Chinese apps will be available for purchase from the App Store? About the Chinese? Chinese apps. Uh, uh, when, when was, in other words, when would Chinese language be supported by Python App Store? The store's language is dependent on the country which the device is launching. Okay. If the Python device will be launched in Thailand, we will support the Chinese language this time. Um, well, I, I don't The app validation store process sounds very good. I just wonder if those automated validation tools that you mentioned there will be made available to us during development so we can run through those before we even submit a Tizen for to make sure that they publish uh, quickly. I'm sorry about that. The automated validation tools that you're using during the app validation, if those tools can be made available to us during development, so we can test our app before submit to your store to make sure that they will pass. That will make it easier for us. Okay, I get you. Yes. Uh, when we developed the test automation system, uh, we considered that we build our automation system and share it to the developer. But our automation system is a server-side system, so unfortunately we can't share it with the developers. But uh, we ever considered that kind of things. Thank you for your question. Hi, uh, I have a question. I have two questions, but the more interesting question is about uh, the rating system. And uh, you mentioned that we can store, you can go and rate an app, and define different, uh, you know, whether it's a good app or medium or bad or you know, rating, app rating, age rating, app, 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 app rating. rating system on the on your store. I don't understand what is a uh, rating for. You mean that rating of application, right? Yeah, quality, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, so, so my question is. Uh, currently, we didn't. We, uh, from now, we didn't build the automated ranking system for application because it's hard to. To check the application quality with the automated system. Yeah. Well, I, I I didn't speak about automating the rating, but I have a question about the rating. Uh, I have a question about the rating system. Like You mean age rating or? No, no, no. The application rating on the store, on the Ryzen store. Uh, we, we need a detailed discussion about the after session. Sure, yeah, go Just a question on in-app subscriptions. So, will you support subscriptions for recurring payment in applications? And if we have a pool of existing subscribers on the web or on iOS or Android who have already paid for subscriptions, how will you support those users? Can they just log into the app experience on Python without going through your store to access our content? How will that work? Um, it is not available now, but uh, we are supporting in-app subscription solution this year. Um, about validation, <coughs> I saw that you were uh, showing the icon size and mm -hmm. circle shape. Yes. What about the navigation inside the application with the footer and header, return key, action key, parameter, and navigation of the <coughs> Are you going to validate that or are you flexible and we have to follow the guidelines? Uh, actually, we only check the, the display icon of the application. So, uh, the representative icon of the application, the display of the device, should be structural shape. 
and others from here. No, but inside the application, yeah. the footer and the header. So Tizen has some guidelines about the return key, the bottom right, the action button in the middle. Are you going to validate that as well, or it's up to the developer? Uh, as I know, the, the Tizen UX guidelines will really be distributed on the Tizen side of this soon. Yeah, I'm developing. I'm in the Tizen developer. Yeah. And you can check it. Okay. But you, you don't validate that? Yeah. Okay. Um, uh, is it possible to support um, outside a separate app store, like for um, uh, outside an individual OEMs? Uh... Yeah, uh, OEMs and manufacturers, uh, OEM and carriers can operate at their own store. So you provide all the infrastructure for, for those uh, purposes? No, it is a it is an independent store, and Python store is a common and mandatory store on Python platform. But uh, OEM and carriers, and if it, if they want, operate their own store on Python on, on the Python platform. Thank you. Regarding ad networks and uh, app uh, validation process, is there any recommended practices how developers can uh, implement ad networks that, that may violate some rules or something? Anyway, Python store will allow the third party in an ad, in an ad solution and not. So in terms of validating the, the process that you mentioned, there are no checks? Coming? Actually, we can check the uh, API using the application, we can check, but if we have a policy, we can get some specific API, we can reject it and filter the validation process. Thank you. That's great.